Let me show you how this and this can help you get your emergency fund started if you don't have one. Stay tuned. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, welcome to another video. Thank you, thank you for stopping by. Wanda is my name and saving money is my game. If you're not saving for emergencies, let's make it yours too. Let's save more in 2024, let's save more money in 2024 and we'll be glad that we did. And I'm asking if you would subscribe to this channel, click the thumbs up button, drop me a comment and let me know what do you think of this video. Is it helpful? Is it a great idea? I'm very curious to know. And would you share this video because there may be someone that can use this content also. And would you click the notification bell so you may be notified every time I upload a new video. I wanna say thank you for being here. Welcome to everyone. And I hope everyone is doing well. And I just wanna put another little reminder that my YouTube channel name is going to be changing. This is what my page looks like. And that Wanda's World Hair Care Journey, it will no longer be that, okay? I just wanna let you know. That way, if you can't find me, you at least know what my page looks like. And all you would have to do is put in the old name, which is Wanda's World Hair Care Journey 5788, and it should take you to the new channel. Okay, all right. Now, like I said, let me show you how this and this can help you get started with your emergency fund. Well, first of all, in order to have an emergency fund, we have to have income. We have to be working, whether it's a nine to five, your own business, um, something where you maybe like doing crafts or YouTube or anything that's making money. You gotta have some money. And sometimes there may be someone in a situation where they're on a low income. Well, if your income is not enough to even cover your bills, you need to do something to increase your income. Like getting a side hustle, there's lots of ways to find extra ways that make extra money. Go on YouTube, put in the search. Ways to make money online, ways to make money at home, ways to make money doing whatever. And that could help you or either go on Google and or either ask someone and that can help you to make some extra money. Well, we gotta have an income and we need to do things like come out of credit card debt. Because when you have a credit card debt, every time you get some money, that's money going towards that credit card. So if you pay that off, that would be like extra money. And we also need to live on less than what we make, watch our spending, stop eating out so much, stop going to Starbucks. You know, sit down and create a budget and see where our money is going. Look at how much is coming in and look at how much is going out and start eliminating things that are not um, wants and if it's not something we don't have to have. If it's a need, that's different. Okay, so those are some things we need to do. And we need to take money out of every time we get some money. If we take small amounts of money, every time we get some money like this, that is $10, that is $10, that equals to $20. $20 is a small amount of money. Now, if you sit down and look at what you're spending money on, I'm sure $20 is going on something that is not a need, okay? So you can take that $20, we have to really be a good steward over our money, watch our spending, watch what we're spending money on. If we're a good steward over our money, you know, that can help us also. Okay, so today's savings challenge, which I have seven, I do one every day of the week. And I'm no, and there may be a possibility that you may not be able to do one every day 
But what you can do is find one of these savings challenges and do one once a week or every two weeks or however you get money. The point is do something. When we take small amounts of money, every time we get some money, it will add up over time. This savings challenge, I started in January and I am amazed. January 2024, I am amazed at what it is now. This is August, I think August 21st today, yeah. I am amazed at how much I've saved and I've been patient, consistent, and disciplined adding into these savings challenges and that's what we need to do. Be patient, consistent, constantly adding and being disciplined. Don't touch it, okay? Well, if you have an emergency that comes up and you have some money, you know, go ahead and cover that emergency, but, you know, put it back when you can. Okay, so today's savings challenge is savings challenge number four, which I do on Thursdays. And it is, uh, this is getting heavy, heavy, heavy. <laughs> uh, I call this my money bag. This is a bag I got from the bank a long time ago. Uh, I used to go there and get quarters every payday. And so they gave me this. And like I said, I had another one. I don't know what I did with it. It's around here somewhere. But anyway, you see that says quarters. Okay, you see that says $1,000. So the goal is to save $1,000 worth of quarters with rows of quarters. That's what kind of gave me the idea when I saw this bag. This could be a savings challenge. And now these savings challenges that I'm doing, they don't have a time limit. We're just doing them just to start and to these videos or to encourage and motivate you to start saving if you're not. So, okay, let me go ahead and show you how much I've saved since January 2024. Okay, let's put you over here. Okay, so put my bag in my lap. I put this in front of me. Hopefully it don't drop in. Okay, so 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. 100, okay, that's $100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, that's $200, all right, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 90, 100, that's $300, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, that's $400, okay, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. That's $500. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. That's 600 Okay, ooh. <laughs> 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, that's 700. Wow, can you believe this? $700, okay. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. Okay, that's $780. Then I'm gonna add these. 
90, 100. That's $800. Wow, all I need is 200 more dollars and I'll have $1,000. So this will be a $1,000 emergency fund. Okay, let me see if I can pick this up. <coughs> yeah. Woo, my goodness. So, like I said, I started this in January 2024. And you know, why don't write this down with my pen? Oh, okay. And so you see how, now, I know you all can't do every one of these table shots, but find one. I have one working with different amounts. Okay, so uh, today is, I said today was the 21st. Today is the 22nd. Thursday, August 22nd, and this is my money bag savings challenge. And I added $20. And the total now is $800. Now, you don't have to do just two rolls. You can do three, four, five, whatever. Just what you can do is just when you go to the bank, if you want to do a 20, get the teller a $20 bill and say, may have two rolls of quarters. Or if you want to do $50, give them a $50 bill or $50 and say, may I have five rolls of quarters. Whatever you want to do, whatever's comfortable for you. But I'm just trying to show you how if you take small amounts of money, every time you get some money, it will add up over time. Because that's what this is doing. It is adding up. And like I said, so in a couple of months, I will have $1,000. Okay, all right, so I hope this video is helpful. I hope you are getting some value out of this video. Drop me a comment and let me know what do you think of this video. Let me know if you're doing this savings challenge. Someone did let me know they were doing this one. And let me know which one is your favorite, okay? And thank you for all the encouraging comments that you all have been leaving me. And thank you for letting me know what you are doing. I'm so happy and proud of you all. Because emergencies come and they can't be avoided. And I want everyone to be ready and prepared when they come. Okay, so thank you for joining me. Thank you for having a safe day. I mean, have a safe day. <laughs> and make sure you keep this money that's in your house in a secure location that's waterproof, fireproof, and not proof. Okay, all right. All right, have a good day. Be safe. And I'll catch you in the next video. And... Happy savings!